Hey what's up guys Rajat here from World of VFX in this video we'll talk about how you can create mega light inside of Unreal Engine 5.5.4 this will be an amazing video so let's get started all right so this is Unreal Engine project browser so firstly we are not going to use this time film and video live events because we are going to use the gaming assets because you can uh, control this third person so simply select this games and then third person and make sure you have to select all these presets like if you want a desktop or mobile just simply select and just rename it on your project name and simply press create so Unreal Engine just now opened and this project I have created earlier which you can see right now. So basically Mega Light is a real time based lighting which is actually reflecting on your character right now as you can see the all the textures which you can see in front of you like a floor or in front of everything it's actually interacting with the character. So this is a revolutionary thing inside of Unreal Engine. So let's recreate how you can create this kind of a thing. So first of all go to file and new level and I'm just creating an empty level simply select and press create now here I'm just creating a new folder to get everything sorted so just name it to tutorial and inside of this we need to import our two footages so simply drag and drop your footage here so it will automatically comes like this you can rename this as well because in this case renaming is very very important so simply select and rename it like 01 and it will automatically 01 rename and make it to 02 now before moving forward you need to turn on one settings so go to edit and here you can find called project settings and here you need to type mega light and you can find this mega lights option you need to check this on because first time whenever you on this unreal engine project file it was turned off so you need to turn this on and that's it you are good to go simply close this now right click you can find this media option you need to select this media player simply select turn on this video output media texture assets and press ok here you can also rename this as well but double click on this now here you can browse your all the media folders so simply double click so this is my first video clip also you can rotate this make sure you have to loop this so that it will continue play and after this make sure save it and close this so once you save and close you can find this thumbnail over here so let's create a basic cube here so simply select take a basic shape like say one cube and let's increase the shape of this cube also i'm just decreasing the width as well also the side view so simply like this now simply just drag and drop this to here so automatically you can see this is added like an as a texture over here now what you need to do just simply double click on this material and it will open on this material browser now what you need to do simply select this rgba and connect this to an emission color once you select this and press apply and save you can suddenly see the lights getting boosting now we need a floor so for the floor i'm just taking another shape so just go to uh, shapes and take a plane and i'm just increasing the plane size a little bit now it will become my floor so just move it little down and that's it so after that what you need to do so simply select here and you can find this called open level blueprints now once you turn and open it you don't need to find this because this is my older one which i have already created so i'm just simply deleted i'm just recreating for this so just right click and simply type event -E and you can find this called event being play simply select this and here you can find this called variables simply type this plus button and type media and here you need to type media player so simply type media media player and you can find this called media player and make sure you need to check this object reference and now you're good to go now simply select this media player you can find this called default value but before moving forward you need to compile this once you compile this settings will turn on and you have to browse your footage so this is my plus one first footage select this drag and drop into here and get media you need to search the source media file so simply search source and you can find this called open source and that's it just connect this to here and you are now good to go we're almost done simply select the flow and change the color to let's say um, something different like this one all right so now go close up and once you play you can find the character over here now if you notice the lights are interacting with the character it's very natural but if you notice this is not that much good so what you need to do just go back and we are adding an area light so simply click here you can find this called light and this is called rec light just take this and this is pretty pretty large just move it little back so that this light can interact with your main lighting source and now simply increase the width 
and it should match with your main input just like this all right and now you can use this source texture with this one simply drag and drop and now if you notice the same exactly source texture is added right over here and just simply zoom the view and just press play and the character is interacting with this and the lights are also moving and this is it guys uh, in this way you can create your mega lights inside of unreal engine 5.5.4 if you really like this video definitely hit the subscribe button make sure you have to comment whatever your thoughts are here and this is amazing go and create and tag me on my instagram handles all links are in description box below see you next time in my next video till then keep watching keep rocking world of effects bye